Hello technical viewers, welcome to EPAD Disapply Private Limited. So we are here to present you the latest uh, uh, project. So the name of the project is Autonomous Solar Grass Cutting uh, Device. So where uh, we have designed our own uh, remote using the uh, NRF module. So here we transmit the uh, information using narrow radio frequencies. So here we have uh, two items you can see. So this is the radio and this is the remote control and uh, this is the vehicle and uh, so let's get uh, into what deep inside the vehicle so the primary top uh, version consists of a solar plate and a solar charge controller where this entire system has been uh, run using battery so for uh, uh, using continuously we use the solar plate and this charge controllers to charge the batteries which are placed at uh, behind so this can switch is used to uh, trigger the charge state whether to charge or uh, not charge and this is for the manual charging so you can charge the batteries using adapter also and then coming to the front side so front side this is the view and uh, here uh, we have the NRF module receiver and uh, the, whereas this is the transmitter so this is the transmitter this is the receiver and uh, we're gonna have uh, a few equipments like this is the compass where it will indicate the direction of the uh, or the facing of the uh, body where this indicates the heading and this is the nano so nano and uh, inside uh, we have Wi-Fi module and uh, we have a uh, new 6m GPS and a motor driver and this and there are four uh, direction controlling motors and this is the grass cutting which consists of a blade also and here uh, we will control the actions using the joystick only this joystick and this is the power switch and uh, here we have the uh, triggering or the uh, on and off switch for this uh, grass cutting uh, blades motor so let's see the manual working right now and we have uh, one more thing to discuss where uh, this also has an ultrasound sensor which, which acts as an obstacle avoidant so if at all if an obstacle is found, you can see the rover is being repaired uh, and avoiding. But the thing is here uh, there is no radio signal. That is why it is behaving like that. So whenever I turn it on, so you can see now the radio we found the radio signal and the device is being uh, brought into a stable condition. And I'm gonna control the device front. Sorry, this is the front actually. So front, this is the back, slow, stop, and right side, and this is the left side. This is the left side. So and uh, this switch, where if I turn on this switch, now you can see the grass cutting has been started and. I can see the LED is running perfectly. Then, if I turn off this, so it will uh, turn off the cutter also. So now uh, let's go out of the uh, room so that we will get the GPS signal. And with the GPS signal, let's have a autonomous drive also outside. So let's go out now. So we are uh, we have gone out of the room, and now you can see uh, we are at. Uh, um, actually uh, late night so not a problem and uh, here uh, we have the uh, basic application where these are the coordinates of the destination location and if we uh, start uh, or if we turn on the switch uh, the vehicle start moving to the location now I will show you uh, how the vehicle behaves so I just press on start now you see the vehicle has already started moving to the location and once the vehicle is reached the location it will stop automatically so you see the vehicle has reached the location and even the switch also has become turned off so this indicates that the vehicle has reached for the location it is ready for the next mission also now you can enter the new coordinates from here and again start the mission and the vehicle drives to the location also so this cycle keep on continues uh, to the new destination location provided so as of this is testing i have provided the destination location as, as short as possible and this is through internet completely autonomous and it, it can be operated uh, from anywhere in the world. So thank you everyone for watching this video. So this is Surya Prakash from EPAT Research Lab signing off. Bye.